Hey, what's up guys? Andrew here. Today I'm going to show you how to reset your Apple M2 MacBook Air back to five-year settings. This is useful if you're planning on returning it, selling it, or you're just having issues with the software in general. All right, guys, let's get started. Okay, so the first step you want to do here is click on the Apple logo here in the top left. Go to System Preferences. Go to Apple ID on the top right. Scroll down, look for Find My Mac. Make sure this feature is turned off so in case you're returning it, you're not going to have an issue with the retailer giving you a refund or the next buyer that's buying it. That way they won't have any issues activating it. Okay, once that's done, click on System Preferences again here in the top left. Scroll down to Erase All Content and Settings. Click on it. Wants you to confirm your Mac password. Put it in right quick. All right, it's going to give you one more confirmation. Erase all content and settings. All settings and media and data will be erased. The following will also be removed. Your Apple ID as well as Touch ID fingerprints used for unlocking this Mac and purchases will also be removed. So in case you haven't backed up anything, now's a good time to cancel this and back up what you need before starting. Okay, so next thing you want to do here is hit continue. Now it wants you to confirm your Apple ID password. Let's go to do that right quick. So once you confirm your Apple ID password, you're going to get one more prompt about erasing all content and settings on this Mac, which cannot be undone. So make sure you back up what you need before hitting this final red button. So we're going to hit that. All right, guys. So once everything's completed, this is the main screen you'll get right here. That means your laptop's been fully wiped, restored back to factory new. All your data and all your sensitive information is fully wiped. Now it's ready for the new owner or back to Apple or back to any retailer if you were planning on returning it or ready for its new owner. So if you're having software issues, you want to hit click next and just set up as new instead of restoring from a backup. So right now it's going to activate your Mac. You will need a Wi-Fi network or network cable to proceed. That way you can reinstall and activate the Mac. So let's try that right quick. So I just reconnected my Wi-Fi network here. Just simply do that. Click on the network right here in the top right and select your network and password. Hit join. Now it's going to activate your Mac. All right, guys, this is about wraps up my video on how to reset your Apple M2 MacBook Air back to factory settings. This method will also work on other M1 and M2 Macs. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to hit the thumbs up and comment and subscribe. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.